Hello, vibrant beings, and welcome to the Beats with your host. I am Kelly Kennedy, and we have started a community of vibing. We are in the vibe movement. We are flowing in our community, and we welcome you to understand how the body really works. Check us out on the first hundred episodes, how the universe works and the body works and how it all works together on the next hundred episodes. As you join us on the Beats, we truly are heart-centered mind opens and guts feeling, looking to dive deep into the rabbit holes to figure out how this all works, how we can do it all better, and how we can work together and collaborate together to be part of a community so we can all increase our frequency, our vibration, and heal the world through love as we know it is. And so it is. Welcome to the Beats. Hello, my vibrant beings. I am so honored and pleased to have David Wong on our show today to talk about frequency, vibration, energy, chi, and our dream coming into reality. So um, I really am so honored to get a chance to meet David a few weeks ago, about I don't know, a month ago or so with my good friend, Dr. Schaffner. And he gave us an opportunity to try out his chi coil. And I got to try it out. And of course, those of you who know us in our office, Ian stole it from me pretty darn quick and has confiscated it in his office. Uh, But we've been using it at home and so forth. And I just knew that I wanted to bring this amazing technology and this amazing man to all of you and to our community. So David, welcome to our community. And I'll let them know you a little bit in our general way that we like to do, but welcome. Thank you for joining us. Yes. Glad to be here. So first of all, David, tell them a little bit about how this all started for you and where you come from and how you got to the point where you created this amazing technology that we've been literally praying for for a couple of years. Yeah, well, um, it's a self-healing journey story. So I was uh, sick with ulcerative colitis. It's an autoimmune disorder, no cure for 10 years. And um, I took medication, which didn't help, gave me side effects and blah, 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 blah. And uh, I tried everything and nothing helped. So I was... uh, doing some soul searching and decided to deepen my spiritual practices and um, research into frequencies and meditation and, and coils and stuff like that. And basically I accidentally healed myself with my experiments. So 90 days after using the the coil with uh, some frequencies for my gut, I healed myself. No more symptoms. My life completely changed. No more chronic fatigue, no more internal bleeding, no more, uh, stress, no more pain, and has so much energy. Um, it was just a complete night and day. So at that point, I said, you know, if I can, I can do this, you know, I need to get this out to the world. First of all, my family, my, my, my parents needed it, my family needed it. And then I started to uh, put all my skills together, which includes like software development, you know, business management, and uh, marketing and, and um, design, and, and, and engineering to create this product that uh, is very affordable and very easy to use for for the whole world to use. There's a lot to unpack there, my friend. And I'm going to start with saying, so you have an engineering background, marketing background, but you also did complete, like, how did you know about frequency and energy? Like you would, you're dealing with all sort of colitis. You're in Western medicine, I presume, allopathic medicine, doing all the drugs for your quote, autoimmune disease, which we're going to be unpacking that. Because if you have an autoimmune disease, supposedly you have it forever, but you just said you don't have it anymore, which is something I'm always talking about because I don't believe there's autoimmune. This is a crazy concept, but t- how you were doing allopathic medicine. I was bo- doing both. I was doing allopathic and um, traditional Chinese medicine, herbs and acupuncture and stuff, but that didn't really work that well either. Okay. Mm-hmm. And how did you end up with frequency? I'm just curious, because that was quite a few years ago, right? Like, uh, yeah, over five years ago. Um, how did I end up with frequency? Um, I was just, well, I'm a musician, first of all, I'm a trained musician. And I've always believed um, that music has an effect on the on the mind and the body. And we know that scientifically now. Uh, so I've always been, you know, creating music and, and being able to pick up certain you know, feelings and emotions from different notes and different sequences and so on. So 
um, when I started experimenting with uh, these specific frequencies that we developed, then I, I felt something I never really felt before. And I, I thought I was onto something pretty big. And, um, and that was pretty evident when I actually healed myself with it. You know, I'm called to say or feel and know right now that when we started this podcast, I never did my incantation because I just jumped in because I was so excited, but I, it, I'm called to do it right now while you just said that. I'm really grateful that you're here with us today, David, and I pray that all the people that are listening to this, when they hear this, that they start to begin to understand how simple it really can be because so many people hear these words, autoimmune, self-healing, and they get often frustrated because they've tried so many things and that haven't experienced that self-healing capacity in the body. They haven't received it. And I really want to give gratitude and the opportunity for people to open their minds, their hearts, and their souls to hear what David's story is exemplifying that he had tried the Chinese medicine, he had tried the allopathic medicine, and yet he kept searching and found frequency and how simple it really became for his body to heal. And I want to unwrap that a little bit, but just for this moment, I want to say with all of your cells in your body, with all the spaces between the cells, with your entire biofield and your entire magnetic field of which you are, we are all energetic bodies having a physical experience. And I pray that all of you can take a deep breath right now with me and David. And just take a moment of pause. Because when we're in this pausing, we're in receiving mode. And I have a feeling that because of the martial arts training, David understood how to receive energy even when he was stressed over his health concern. Because what I want you all to become aware of is that there's different gears in the body and we've got to be in the gear of receiving for this type of subtle body energy to have the incredible impact that it will always have. It can just be miraculous feeling when you're in that true receiving. So I ask you all to receive this information today. Investigate this for yourself if this too, truly does resonate with you and know that all the answers you've ever dreamed of and ever have been able to think of are already created in the universe. And this is a perfect example of this. We have so much gratitude for what you have done, David, with all your background this industry has needed something that's truly affordable and effective that is scalable from the perspective that they start with one place, they can keep getting better and better and optimizing. And it's very obvious what you have created. So I really, so it is for all of those things and allowing everybody to feel this. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you all for giving us the opportunity to do that. So yeah. frequency when, when you got into frequency and healing of that, how did it first start with you? Because obviously the music background allowed you to see, feel, and know that mm -hmm. sound heals. Is that where you started with sound frequency? Yeah, just sound frequencies. Um, but then uh, I got gravitated into sacred geometry uh, because, you know, the universe has certain numbers that uh, exist ever since the beginning of time, certain geometries. You know, you take a look at the pyramid, it's built to a very precise geometry for a specific reason, because the shapes actually have resonance and actually have frequencies. So what we what we did was we actually, um, you know, took, let's say, um, the frequency of Earth, right, and which is uh, 7.83, right, and we took that frequency, we built harmonics on it based on uh, phi ratios, if you're familiar with that, 1.618, uh, you know, so all this I don't want to, you know, boggle you with numbers, but basically nature has these very specific numbers that have existed since the beginning of time. And what we found is that um, they heal. These frequencies heal and it brings your mind and your spirit into its optimal frequency or optimal position or optimal uh, vibration. So when we know these numbers, we can use technology today, software programs, coils and whatever to project and basically send these frequencies into your body or into your mind. 
and thereby you are like experiencing the fullness or the wholeness or the completeness of the universe inside of your body and your mind. Mm. That's it right there. That's how it works. So let's unpack that a little bit. So back up everything in the earth, everything has a vibration, earth, sky, wind, rain, they all have a vibration, correct? And so when you say that something's all of nature has math, right? My brain goes and shuts down back in the day. It shut down. The first time I heard all of this was through Sound of Soul. And I was like, what do you mean? I don't want to do math. I'm a scientist. I don't want to do math. I'm a biologist. And then I started to understand Fibonacci and the golden ratio and the sacred geometry in a deep way. So can we really talk about what that means? So what do you mean by sacred geometry and nature has these numbers? Can you explain that a little bit more? Um, well, let's talk about the phi ratio, right? 1.618 is a very specific number. It's because um, that's how um, galaxies are proportioned, right? So let's say- a fifth, uh, it, in, the, in the accordance of a fifth, like in music, and in, in the note of a fifth is what you're talking about? Something like that. So for example, um, like your your face, your head here, Right, this part and this part is 1.618 of, of this part, okay? Or you just look at your hand, this part, the length of your hand, this part is 1.618 of this part, and this smaller part is 1.618 of the other part. So it's all mathematical, it's all uh, multiplication. A pattern. It's, it's a, a pattern. pattern. Yeah. Patterns in nature that are represented by specific numerical, you know, that can be measured, exactly. that are repeating patterns in all of nature. Exactly. So, and that it like you see corals, another example, sunflowers, apples, you know, everything in nature is basically structured or built or according to this design. Uh, and so that's where 1.618 comes in. It, it is a ratio of, um, of nature, of universe. So when we use that frequency, we built frequencies um, based on that ratio, then we actually produce that harmonic that will um, emulate that frequency from nature. So you can use that. How do you use that? You can use that to amplify whatever you want to do, okay? So let's say you have an intention in your mind or during meditation, you can use that frequency, playing our frequencies, right? The sound or the coils, and it will help you amplify that intention. As well, you can do it without meditating and it's still going to affect you because that's the frequency that is going to help you anyway, regardless of whether you're actively doing it or not. Right. And that's what I was trying to explain earlier, that if you're in receiving mode, you're going to receive it easier. If you're not in receiving mode, you're still going to get it. It's just not going to be as quick of a shift to from, from frequency to matter. Mm -hmm. Because all of life is a frequency, then it eventually gets to matter the more energy behind it and the more action behind it to create the result of the matter that we're looking to create. I love these conversations. They're so fascinating. So the, the amplify, no, the harmonics, let's go back to harmonics. I'm not a musician. So when you say harmonics, again, my brain kind of goes, huh, what's he talking about? So there's this, can you explain harmonics a little bit? Well, I think it's better. I, I just show you. <laughs> oh yeah. Show us David. So, so, um, so we have this tablet, it's called the resonant console. It has over 10,000 programs, 800 proprietary meditation frequencies with 10,000 Rife programs. It's, it's incredible. So we put it on here. It's also on our website and we got all these frequencies. So like, for example, uh, one would be like this one, Recharge, okay? So by the way, we give away these frequencies for free, eight of them for free. And these eight are on very powerful. Website. You can go to his website and listen to eight frequencies that are designed to help you heal for free free yeah so you listen to this one so that's built on the phi ratio that's based on one frequency that helps the body to energize itself and if you listen to this in about 20 to 30 minutes you'll feel like whoa <laughs> Or even some people will, will feel it quite quickly. 
But as you, if you hear, if you know music, there's actually layers of notes on in in this Super in this sound, right? It's not just one sound. It's just not one one note. There's actually many notes, and it creates this pleasant tone, and that's what we call the harmonic. Okay. So, so we, harmonic is like a complex homeopathic. So instead of having one single remedy with a homeopathic where you're just diluting belladonna 200C, you have a complex homeopathy that some of you are familiar with have worked with us, where you've got five different remedies with five different dilutions. So the body's taking whatever frequency it needs. So right. like harmonics is taking that frequency and mm, comprehensively packaging that frequency is that a way to understand that well it's, it's how music is made right if you think about a symphony you got so many different instruments they're all playing something different but then they all work together to create beautiful music um come contrast that with just one note like mm, i mean it's it's just a note right it doesn't do much right people they, they obsess over 432 or 528 well it's just one note yes that note itself is significant and maybe you get a little tiny buzz with it but until you create harmonics with it, it's not it's not going to do much, okay? Um, unless you turn it into magnetic frequencies, which we'll talk about later with the right frequencies. So, uh, so we have different kinds of frequencies, different dimensions of it, right? One dimension, two dimension, three dimension, four dimension, and so on. So, um, and it'll take you some time to kind of understand this and experience it for yourself. But like like we we all know about, or many people know about rife frequencies. Dr. Reif, back in the 1930s, he used specific frequencies, electromagnetic um, generator to cure 13 cancer patients in a clinical trial. After that, he was assassinated. That's why people say, who knows, right? But most likely. And um, since then, people are trying to be, uh, have tried to recreate his technology. And some people have succeeded, most people have not. Um, but when I came into the, um, place or, or into this market, I found that there were all these very expensive, huge, giant machines that were very difficult to operate. That took probably a month or two months to learn how to use. Uh, and that were based from 1930s technology. Hmm. So I said, well, there's got to be a better way to do this. And there's got to be something smaller, something easier to use so that everybody can experience this technology and experience this healing. So yeah. I created the cheek coils and it made them this small. And this is stronger. This is this is two and a half inches. Look how, how small they are. And they're light and they fit in your pocket. So these are stronger than the $35,000 machines that are out there right now. Okay, this is confirmed by multiple doctors, surgeons, chiropractors, and so on. And this is starting at $399. And you can finance it if you want. Okay, and you can use it forever. As long as you want. Un uh, unlimited. You don't need any refills. You don't need to go to anywhere to get it. You can use it at home. So now you are empowered to take control of your own health and also the health of your entire family. Because when you're using this, it has an energy field. You don't even have to touch it. It broadcasts energy around three feet radius. This is the small one. Now, if you want to broadcast energy throughout your whole house and create a healing environment, you get this, the you call aura, which is actually pretty big. It's this big if I get close to it. The one that's behind you. Yeah, it's, it's two by two feet. See, if I come, it looks small in the screen, but you see how big it actually is. Right. My body. So this one will cover an entire home or entire uh, clinic, office, retreat center. And that covers 3,000 square feet up to 6,000 square feet if you get multiple ones. So, so we're creating healing environments. We're not just creating, um, you know, something that you need to take. It's not a pill. It's not something you have to hold on to. Some, it's not something that you have to actually set aside time to use because once you create the environment all you have to do is be in it yeah and, yeah. and you don't ever what i love about it is there's no upgrade like in three years from now the software is not going to be upgraded like this is just what it is mm -hmm. this is as upgraded as it can get right i mean this is this this shape is called torus donut right it's called right. torus the reason we use this shape is because the torus, once again, connecting with sacred geometry is how nature creates energy, right? If you take a look at, once again, galaxies, tornadoes, whirlpools, they go in, it's a vortex. They portals, they're all, it's a vortex, okay? 
And if you study into how this was uh, all the geometry behind this, it's actually this flower of life. So if you're familiar with flower, flower of life, it's got the six, six circles inside one circle, right? And um, it's inside the coils. So you look at our chi coil max. Oh yeah, now you can see it. Yeah. Now you can see more clearly. It's yep. inside. So the geometry is built in to the coils, and now you get to experience many levels of these um, nature's harmonics. You know, experiencing it on the sound level of sound, having those sacred geometries built into the sound. Now with these, experiencing the shape of nature with sacred geometrical, geometrical actual shapes from the coils. And we all know that, and we use copper, which is uh, also, you know, um, has metaphysical properties. And, and organic properties, because I've studied organ for years. And this one is gold, is it not? It's gold, gold enamel. So it's not actual gold plated. Okay. So- um, But does it have so, copper in it? I was curious. Yes, it's, it's copper. It's copper. It's gold enamel oh, copper. It's gold. Okay, got it. Yeah. And, and, and then the crystal, this is a crystal that it's in. Uh, yeah, so that's crystalline orgone that's in. And inside the crystalline orgone, we put another crystal called quantanium crystal, which is, let's see, let's focus on this. So there's actually three of those inside the coil. You can't see them oh. just in the video, but if you look closely, you can see these terminated six-sided yeah. crystals inside, which add an additional technology crystal resonance in the coil. So we pack like five or six different technologies into one thing into one compact thing. So you can imagine, you don't have to imagine, you will experience the um, transformations and, and the, the healing and, and the shifts um, in, in a very profound level with it once you start using. And we've been using it in clinic for just a couple of weeks, but um, I would say that while it's useful in clinic, it's also, I would say, really great for home use. I mean, I know for us, we're always looking for how people can you know, solve more problems at home and not be so dependent on coming to a clinic and, and long-term, you know, cause they're going to find new ways to create new toxins and new burdens for us. And our job is we live in these beautiful homes that are protecting us from all the elements yet maybe we're inside too much. I would conjecture and that the nature of the human being needs to have access to more of the nature outside and, you know, I live in the Northeast. There's plenty of months. I'm not, in, I'm not into hanging on outside because of the weather. Whereas things such as the chi coil can replicate or even magnify what nature has. Yes, precisely. So, so we were talking about nature having frequencies, right? So that's why when we go to a retreat center, we go to the beach, go to the forest, we feel very connected and we feel actually healthier. A lot, a lot of people just heal themselves just being in nature. So, um, but we can't be there all the time, right? We live in the city, we have jobs, we have careers and we have Wi-Fi, and we have to use our cell phones and so all these like crazy 5G radiation everywhere. So how do we protect ourselves and how do we thrive in our everyday environments? That's the problem, right? Well, Qi Close is the answer because you can replicate these frequencies and these energy fields that are from nature. And all you have to do is turn it on. So now you turn it on, you've created this bubble around you, it bubble around your home, and you, you can negate all those harmful radiations of mm -hmm. 5G. No longer do they uh, affect you because you're, you're increasing the energy field of your own body, your own bioenergy field. So you're so resilient that it doesn't matter like these 5G Wi-Fi around you, it, does, it just bounces off. I'm so glad you brought that up. So, you know, they're now creating 10G. Did you know that? Did you see it in the last two weeks? Really? No. Yeah, that's the new that's the new news in the last two weeks. 10G. Okay. We went from five to 10. But right. But here's the point. And I, I feel the same way. And I, I think you're going to agree with me that the frequency of the human is so much stronger than anything we can possibly create mm -hmm. that we will always maintain our integrity as long as we're re charging our our human field mm -hmm. and we're not just degrading it all the time by typical western culture living um but do you feel that we are as strong as every computer and every satellite and all the technology i mean you're an engineer so i'm merely well, yeah we, 
I mean, we have the potential to be stronger than all of those things. We, we have unlimited potential, actually, right? Because we were created in the image of God. So we have unlimited potential. Um, I mean, look at the, you know, the ancient Chinese writings and the, and the lore, and even in the Greek lore, you see these superhumans with the psychic abilities and superhuman strength and things like that. It's like, was that actually real or is this just made up? I think it's real. Because back then, we were just so much more connected with nature. And we were able to unlock these abilities inside us. And maybe it was even normal place for people to have these abilities. But then over time, because of all these um, disruptions of our frequencies uh, you know, that, that come from our food and from our environments, it basically took that away. So, so, so yes, our bodies, if we train it, we can have that, those superhuman abilities. And we can have you know, ultra health and so on. Um, chi calls and frequencies may not, you know, you, you can use these technologies, which I think is the best, but there's many technologies um, that can use, you can use as a tool to get you back to that place, to get you back to that um, optimal performance. And, and going back to your story, David, if you would, so when you had the ulcerative colitis and you started using sound therapy at first, did you notice an impact right away? Or did you have to use it for some time before you saw an impact? Oh, the first day I used it, I had, um, I reduced my symptoms and mm. I felt it right away. So, um, and was that like sound bowl therapy or hmm? what, what kind of sound therapy did you try at first? I was I, at that point, I, I converted the sound into electromagnetic frequencies. So I was using, um, uh, a specific one. I was using different ones, including there, which are included in the software. Uh, and then I'm using the rife frequencies too. So, so that's the thing, right? Cause a lot of people use rife frequencies and then they're not really getting results, but once they, uh, add our quantum frequencies, which is the harmonics that are talked about together with the rife, then holy cow, then it, then it takes it up to a much higher level because yeah. why we, yeah, it amps it up because the, the harmonics kind of like prepare the body and open up the, the, the energy field or start, starts moving the chi in the body so that the right frequencies can start doing the, the target, the healing. That's why I think it's happening. And that's what I see is so brilliant is that your, your equipment gets people into that receptive mode by healing their magnetic field, allowing them to be a better antenna so that when the proper frequencies of light, sound, color, whatever the frequency is sent, with rife, you can use it just as sound or you can amplify it into the magnetic field as well. And then the body's in more receptive in able to receive a more amplified frequency. Exactly. So that's, that's how it's working. And that's something very unique that nobody else is doing. Okay. So, um, and that's why we're getting such incredible results. So some like people who have been in depression for years, uh, one young lady who's a musician and she reached out to me and said, Oh, I need your help. So I said, okay, just get she calls and use it. And so she used it for 21 days, just 20 minutes a day. And then after that, she, we had a call and then she told me, oh my God, David, you wouldn't believe how my life is completely transformed. I had so much creativity. I started writing music again. This person that was on my dream board for five years, I actually have a tour with him now. To wow. go on tour, out of nowhere. So she was able to manifest her dreams. And also she's like, I have so much energy. I'm so positive, I have so much optimism. I have so much creativity, it's it just mind blowing. So, so this is the kind of shifts that we, we hear about all the time. Um, even for pain or even for um, someone who's healed their back, uh, somebody broke their back 40 years ago from a soccer game, which never healed. So he was suffering from intense pain every day for 40 years. So his wife bought the coil, used it on him for 60 days and no more pain. And he's, much better. His personality actually shifted too. He was well, a much sure. nice. Yeah. His, yeah his, I mean, I, as a person that lived in pain for three years, when you get out of pain, your personality shifts because you're not so fucking pissed anymore of how you feel. Exactly. Yeah. He wasn't <laughs> pissed anymore. He was actually, he started being very loving and very caring and doing chores around the house, which he never did for 40 years. <laughs> well, sold to all the women in the, in the audience right there. Now, in all honesty though, do you have like case studies that you've done? I mean, these are awesome clinical pearls and, you know, clinical experiences that people have had, but have you done actual case studies as a, you know, as an engineer, I'm going to figure the answers. Yes. Yeah. So we've done, um, 
we've done uh it wasn't all by chance and some some uh clinical we've experience. Done depression anxiety studies we've done um chronic fatigue studies we've done sleep studies and you know across the board basically everybody uses our frequencies cheek coils uh the cheek coils work about 34 percent better than just the frequencies mm, that's okay. that's so, interesting so, so the the frequencies um well, we found that frequencies help with like mental issues, whereas the uh, coils help more with like the the energy in the body, the physical, yeah, the physical aspect. But you know they're all connected, right? I mean, yeah, right. You can't connect mind body. You can't disconnect mind body and spirit as hard as they they're trying out there. But we're mm -hmm. we're here to back help you reconnect because when we connect back to source, we come from love. I mean, I, I just, when, when we're not connected to source, it's all about fear. Cause you feel like the untethered soul that's out there just flying around and no, no idea what you're connected to and what's the reason behind all of it. And when you're connected to your source, when you're connected to self, you feel nothing but connection to everybody and to everything. And you feel it in your physical body. So to back up this, the frequencies that are available on your website, which there's, I think you said nine, eight or nine that are free. Then you can buy a whole bunch more. And if you want to buy them just independent, you don't need a key coil, a chi coil. You can just listen to the sound frequencies. And how do you determine like the sound frequency that helps the body recharge? How did you figure that out? There's many different um, methods and we blend them in our different levels of frequency. So the one that you heard, like the recharge, that's just based on uh, pulse electromagnetic field therapy, oh. PMF therapy. Right. Um, we already know that certain hertz, like about 25 hertz, will, will energize the body. So we build harmonics on that. Um, if you go higher levels of frequencies, you go like quantum, higher quantum, inner circle, and so on. So those are our different tiers. Then you start getting into the four dimensional frequencies, right? So, like one of them that uh, we can play now is the pineal gland one, which is actually, I played it for you last time, right? Yes, he did. And I felt it as soon as you put it on again. It, when he did it, I mean, you guys. Feel that right here. Yeah, so so you can feel it, right? Like wow, right? I so mean, I feel it. my my frontal lobe is just like sensing sensing right now. You can feel it, like so. It, it feels like your brain just woke up from something. Mm -hmm. Um, so so that's uh, another thing. So you, if you if you're studying music, it's like, okay. There's a beat that goes. And then there's these notes that go do, 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 but they're not actually notes in the keyboard. There's these specific things and they're a little bit off the actual notes from the keyboard. So, uh, and the reason this is that tick, 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 that's, that's called uh, asynchronistic tones. And mm -hmm. it kind of gets your brain into these frequencies, like click, click, it's like tapping, right? Mm -hmm. So you're stimulating- Brain uh, coherence, to create yeah, brain coherence. Brain coherence, right? And then yeah. we have these frequencies um, that we found you know, directly stimulate those parts of your brain, kind of like vibrate that deep part pineal gland inside of the middle of your brain. So that's how we figure it out. Uh, there's other techniques that we use, like we use, like, for example, we have um, DMT, right? Or we have ayahuasca and people love this. And they, when they listen to this, they're like, they feel like they're on ecstasy or they feel like they're on the actual ayahuasca trip um, without taking any ayahuasca. <laughs> with just frequencies right so that's the wild part about it I mean, here, here's that's, the that for me is the beauty of it right there because you don't have to take the matter and then go through all the physiological like I, i'm personally a person I, I cannot imagine what circumstance would show up in my life that i go yeah i want to do ayahuasca because throwing up is the worst thing on the planet for me so anything where the side effect is throwing up i'm not in <laughs> I love the concept of ayahuasca, but I've never wanted to do it. But this, I did the other day. Yeah, so this is DMT, right? Yeah, that wasn't so easy with earphones on, I got to tell you. That was not pleasant. So yeah. do you often play these without the earphones? Uh, I, you can use earphones. Um, maybe just turn it down a bit. Don't listen yeah. to too, too loud. Yeah. It might be too loud. It turn down the, the volume. So some of these are pretty intense, okay? Um, like that's DMT. You can try oh, this ayahuasca one. Yeah, 
Yeah, this is the one I did. I feel it in my legs every time. It's so weird. I get these sensations in my legs. Yeah, so so we have, uh, that's just one track. We have like 20 tracks that, that go with this. And and how we build those is with um, molecular geometry. So like we, Alaska has an active ingredient. We can look up and find the actual geometry of how the molecules stick together. And then um, we extract it uh, with a software program. We extract the, the numbers out of there. Then we create these frequencies. So when you're listening to it or you're playing through the coils, you're actually creating this hologram of ayahuasca. Of and your ayahuasca. body is receiving it as a hologram. It's, it's so future medicine and we're right here right now. It's so exciting. And so just so everybody reiterates, so you got sound frequencies that are created in harmonics that are allowing you to receive better more intently these frequencies that are in all of the universe, then you can further amplify those frequencies of sound, put them through the chi coil, and then it creates a magnetic field mm -hmm. resonating the same frequency that the sound is creating, correct? Yes, but there's no sound coming from the coils. So right. don't get confused. It's just a feeling. It's a feeling and also it's a magnetic field. So people say, okay, I can't see anything. What's, what's actually coming out here? So what we actually show people is, okay, we give them a magnet. The strongest yeah. healing gold magnet. I mean, trust me, don't, he, he, the pack, man. Holy cow. I tried to take one off and the little white yeah, just yeah, yeah. flying across it's the pretty, room. It's pretty difficult to take out. They are difficult. They are strong magnets. Yeah. So, so like once I connect, so I use Bluetooth. I connect it to this, right? This comes with the, the kit. Yeah. This is like the power. So there's these two, everything. I mean, you could use Bluetooth, but I use the actual auxiliary. Um, so, can you, yep. so can you see this little magnet yes. moving around? Yep, there you so, go. So you see how this spinning around that, that little jar? So that's the actual magnetic energy coming out of this coil. Yep. Beautiful. Okay, so, so that's, so now you can physically see what's coming out of it, right? I and mean, we don't need the magnet. There's much, the energy is still coming out, you see? And, you know, and then- it's so funny because people are skeptical, right? Like right. they're literally looking at this perhaps on their computer, watching a video that was recorded weeks ago that we're in two different cities and we're not communicating all this non-verbal communicate, all this non-linear information is flying through the waves and creating a video, but people get skeptical to think that this can send energy and heal. Can you speak to that for a moment? Well, I mean, first of all, the the fundamental of this technology is not new. Uh, there's a lot of scientific uh, studies done in it. For example, like uh, it's based on pulse electromagnetic field therapy, PMF therapy. And if you just search on um, any uh, government or even uh, what Google do you call Scholar. it? Yeah. Um, like, for example, I'll, I'll, I'll quote some of the uh, studies done, like a Journal of Clinical Psychology in 19, uh, 2016. They found electromagnetic frequency therapy reduced symptoms of depression and anxiety in patients with major depressive or disorder. Also in a randomless trial published in the journal of PLOS One in 2015, found that electromagnetic frequency therapy improved sleep quality, reduced symptoms of post-traumatic stress disorder in military veterans. Another review in the Journal of Cancer in 2018 found that PMF therapy may have potential as an adjunct therapy for ca cancer treatment as it can enhance the effects of chemotherapy and radiotherapy while also reducing side effects. Okay, and it goes on. Journal of Alternative Complementary Medicine. Uh, PMF therapy helped reduce symptoms of chronic fatigue syndrome. And it also helped neurodegenerative diseases such as Alzheimer's and Parkinson's. And another study says it reduces medication in patients with muscular skeletal pain. So those are just some. We can, there's actually thousands of studies uh, of research that showed that electromagnetic frequencies heal mind and body. So this is not new. This kind of like so-called technology has been around for 80 or 100 years. It's just that now I've created something that's compact, powerful, mobile, and versatile that everybody can use. And thank you for doing that, truly, truly, because I've been in this industry for 18 years and 
we often go to Germany because we're but in bottom bottom. And I think we mentioned it too. Dr. Schaffner and I mentioned it too, that but it's the largest medical week conference in all of Europe. And it's where we find the greatest technology, often German and Russian technologies that are so much far more far advanced than often we can find here in the States. And at a price point, that's often pennies on the dollar compared to what we find in the States. And you know, I've been around frequency generators and bio resonance machines and light therapies for 20 years. And there's a lot of wolves in sheep's clothing out there. And there's a lot of people spend a lot of money on what I wouldn't spend $200 on that they spent tens of thousands of dollars on. And that's what I really want to create gratitude, sorry, gratitude for you in so many ways is that you've made this, when you first told me that this was available to a client in their home for 500 bucks. Now, the kit and caboodle I got was not 500 bucks, right? It's like 20 grand for this whole, everything you could possibly get from David, like the, the gold magnets, the key coil, the tablet, all the downloading of all the frequencies. It's That's not 20,000. The, the system you have is the Chico 3, Chico oh, okay. 3 system, right? This one, this is 3,500. 3,500, okay. Yeah. But you uh, have one that's everything, right? Uh, like when, well, you, when well our, our biggest system it, it, is four of these. Oh, four of those. Four okay. of those. That's like $27,000, but, okay. um, but that would cover a very, very large place. So 3,500 uh, is what you would need to spend for like a clinic to be mm -hmm. able to get them to have everything. Cause that's what I, I wanted all the frequencies yeah. so that we so have for about for a clinic, about $5,000 will get you uh, all the frequencies plus the, plus the kit five to 6,000. Yeah. Yeah. That, that would be, um, you know, we call it like the professional package. Right. right? Whereas like somebody that um, is on a budget, right. They can just get the Chico mini. There's just one coil with um, eight free frequencies. And you can subscribe for $10 a month and you get 10,000 right frequencies. So that's basically what everybody needs. And that's 399. So, right. and it's financeable. Very, very affordable and very effective. So I interrupted you earlier, but do you have your own specific case studies? I know you just read a lot of case studies in regards to the benefits of pulse electromagnetic field technologies and the benefits of the magnetic field technology in general. But do you have personal studies you've all done? Um, we've done a lot of work with the BioWell camera, you know, the um, the Aura camera, GDB camera, to measure the energy fields. Um, and then 30 minutes later, we consistently increased energy field 30% wow. in people. Uh, and you know how before, if you measure the before and after, right? So when you measure the before, people will find like uh, one organ or one system that has low energy. And all we do is just play that frequency for that organ or system. And in 30 minutes, we can we do another reading, we can show it the energy just went back up. So it's very precise um, how these frequencies work. So you're not so concerned about the Wi-Fi and the, the, the negative, the dirty electricity that's coming off your computer and all the things because you're creating a field that's so strong in the positive frequencies that your body is gravitating and, and has an affinity for that it's actually strengthening you throughout the day. Yes, exactly. Yeah, exactly. It's that easy, y'all. It's simple. It's simple. It's right? simple. What? Yeah. Um, I made it I made it simple. You just turn it on and you got this automated life force generator, right? You got this automated uh, energy that's going to start transforming yourself 1% a day. Well, you know, when we first met, I had used the word grounding for a very long time, I don't know, 30 years or something. I've been using grounding. I mean, the earthing book came out. We'd been doing that for 10 years by the time the book came out, right? And I don't know what it was about our conversation, but I got off the phone with you and the next client I saw, I said, I need you to recharge every day. And they were like, huh? I'm like, you need to go outside and recharge for the first five minutes of your day. Put your feet, bare feet on the ground, on the, on the ground, actual dirt and recharge your body. Or they're like, oh, you mean grounding? I was like, well, it's not just grounding though. 
grounding denotes like I'm bringing me down, right? But it's like recharging you. I mean, that's how I feel when I go outside on the ground. I feel recharged. And I, I think it denotes like this magnetic field that I was, after our conversation, I was like, yeah, I'm not talking enough about that. Like there's a magnetic field that our bodies are. It's this torrid that's mm -hmm. positive and negative ions. It's constantly moving, ever evolving, ever changing. And it's picking up energy in and it's sending energy out. And it's, yeah. it's this bi-directional all the time. But most people's fields are like broken and have holes in them and because of all the one directional Wi-Fi and microwaves and cell phones and, and the unconsciousness more than anything of knowing that all that stuff is affecting them. And I've known it for 20 years, which is why I think I'm healthier than most people that I meet because I'm very aware and conscious of my biofield and do things to recharge it all the time. And so when something like this comes in my life, I mean, Dr. Christine and I were like, we've been praying for something like this, easy, affordable, programmable, that gives us access to upgrade the frequency of the body simply, easily, and comfortably, and gently, and over and over and over again, that doesn't have this like end game where it's like, oh, you got to pay for my membership for the rest of your life in order for me to keep making your frequency better. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, you know, that's not how life works. And yeah. I love how you've combined the ancient wisdom right? From TCM, from traditional Chinese medicine, from the pyramids, from sacred geometry and all the things that we've known about how life works, of how, how to create a life force within us that I would conjecture most of us. I look at live blood all day, y'all. And there's a lot of lack of life force out there. There's some people with no endobions. There's people with no vitality in their cells and the cells aren't moving it's live blood it should be moving and oftentimes it's not moving and i just see it as such an attack that our lifestyle is such an attack on our human biology and physiology and and physics and what you've created to make all this ancient technology in one so you can sound you can magnify it color i don't know how you're getting color in this but go outside in the sun while you're look doing at it. it you're just looking at it yeah look at it <laughs> look at the gold it's pretty yeah and gold is the highest frequency of metals correct i think so yeah I think it is. yeah yeah so, so i mean my my mission that 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 thanks for saying all that um which brings you to my mission my mission is just to raise the frequency of the world and to see one million people healed through this technology as a start. Uh, you know, I, I use my life as an example of somebody who was just so desperate for, for a healing and just so desperate for a change, um, who finally found something that was easy and that actually, you know, had made a huge difference. And uh, being able to completely transform myself from depression, disease, sickness, and darkness into a life of being very productive, very happy, very centered um, and successful as well, right? Uh, and super healthy and being able to live my life purpose, which is to help other people, to, to heal other people and to lead other people to, um, to become better, to become better people and to become their optimal self. So that's why I'm doing this and I really think that um, this technology, if not from me, if some, some, someone else, it could potentially change the world. And, and I agree with your mission and I'm on the same mission because of my own story. And I, from our heart to yours, that's why we're on this podcast from the beats, because we want you all to know that healing capacity inside you, we've both experienced it. And there's easy ways for you to now access it. And if you haven't felt it, if you haven't felt tingles, all of you've had an orgasm, right? You know what you feel like after you have an orgasm? That's energy running through your body. That's called organ. Organ. Wilhelm Reich fell away from Freud because Freud said it was all about the orgasm. And Wilhelm Reich said, no, it's about organ. Orgasms create organ. It's the life force energy that's inside all of us. From a pleomorphic dark field blood microscope perspective, it's the endobions that 
are in the spaces between the cells when you're a healthy person. And mm -hmm. when, when I met David, I was like, wow, here's this incredibly put together businessman who has created an incredible technology in this space. And listen, I'm going to be the one that calls it out. We all know he's a little salesy and that's okay because that is why David's where he's at because he needed to use all of his skill sets to bring this to market and thank God for him because if he wasn't that person, I would have never found him ever. And so many people in our industry would have. So let that go because I feel you all and I'm done with it because what you have to understand is this man has not known me for two months and took a chance on us and took a chance on our community and gave us an opportunity to experience this. I don't know as if I would have done it without his hand, his, his reach out to me as he did uh, um, six weeks ago or whatever it was. I, there is no time and space. So it's really hard for me to manage time and space, but I'm, I can only imagine where you're headed with this because what you've already done is incredible and how much free things that you've made available to people to let them experience it first and foremost for themselves. They don't have to believe you and I, they can believe it by experiencing it. And yeah. that's what I want for this whole world is to stop talking about self-healing and experience self-healing, experience that flow of chi in your body. And I I do flow. So I'm going to shut up and I want David to explain flow. Flow. Okay. Well, flow is a state. It's uh, like from personal experience is when you feel like everything's working very effortlessly and you're moving in the direction that you've always wanted to go and it's fun. It's easy. You're relaxed and you're just on, you're just going on for the ride. That's what flow is. And yeah, that's it. Yeah. And and um, and I'm experiencing it right now. So whereas I like I said, I used to be in depression, panic panic attacks, um, you know, disease, sickness, and you know, financially broke as well, and um, just in a very dark place for ten years. And I was able to shift and transform myself quite rapidly um, using frequencies. And now I'm very happy. I'm uh, living my life purpose. I'm building strong relationships with people. I'm attracting the good things and repelling the bad things. You know, before, you know how sometimes you always attract just the wrong people, wrong opportunities, wrong events in your life. Well, that doesn't happen anymore. Um, now I only attract the good, positive, beneficial, uh, and, or, or mutually beneficial opportunities and, and relationships. So, so it's because when you change your frequencies, it, it changes reality. It changes what you attract. Changes your magnetic field and you attract who you are. Exactly. Yeah. So you become some, you become, and then you attract. Yeah. Right. Um, and you become either two ways, outwardly in or inwardly out. Right. Mm. So, I mean, you can do it both ways, but I think the easier way is just do the inwardly out with the technology. Just, just change your frequency and everything else will change. Right. A lot of people, they change you know, the way they talk, you know, neuro linguistic programming. They go to the gym and get a better body. They go take a course. They study this, which are all great, but that's from outward in. So what this technology does is does the other way, which is the yin way. You know, the yin is the feminine, the yang is the masculine. The yin way is being internal, subtle, gentle, passive. So we use the yin method, which is just to change your frequency from the inside and everything else on the outside changes. And it is about the balance. And to that point, he made one of these yin and one of these yang. So that there was a balance of masculine, feminine, give and receive. And you just don't put them up at your head. I don't mean to put them in my head. Anywhere else but your head. Yeah. <laughs> That's yeah. that flow state and that the yin and the yang, the the it, it is about the balance, right? But I, I agree with you. When people that have known me for I'm 49 years old. So when I've been in this industry for 26 years, that people that knew me before, when they see me now and they haven't seen me in 10 or 15 years, they're like, what are you doing? Like, I don't understand. You have an age, you're actually going backwards. And people that know me say that to me anyway. Oh, I haven't seen you in a year. And how do you look, except for my gray hair, how do you look younger and more vibrant and more vital? And you have a 10 year old when you're 40 and what happened? And this is some good shit we got going on here. It's called quantum 
baby. Yeah. It's quantum frequency and it really does heal you from the inside out. And as my insides got to be quantum geometrical sacred geometry shapes as they healed the water inside me as it structured all the water inside me it could hold on to the frequency of the information of nature that was healing me because i was in a more receptive mode now because my structured water was holding information so that by the nature of walking through the woods or breathing air or sitting in the sun or putting my feet on the ground i'm able to receive god's given beauty of healing inside my body and my nervous system then takes all that information and then processes it and sends it out to my organs and tissues and does all the things and all the mechanisms that my body needs to do to be able to create a self-healing capacity that's going to poop out, pee out, sweat out, and I would contend bleed out and breathe out more toxins than we're taking in. That for me is the flow state, adapting appropriately to the to the place we're in and allowing our bodies to continually upgrade and optimize because I have a lot of life to live. And I want all of you to be vibrant beings with me because there's a lot of fun to be had. I mean, David, I've only got a cracked smile out about 10 times, but I know he's a lot of fun because you're not a fun guy. You got to create this. You're a fun man because you are sometimes, really wanting. Sometimes too fun. I don't act my age a lot of times. Oh. Well, by the way, I'm 42. I'm not 20 something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was going to ask you that because genetically, we know that you often look younger anyway, but yeah. just in general, you do yeah. not look 42. Yeah. Even for <laughs> my, <laughs> you know, for Asians, I actually look younger for as an Asian. Yeah. Compared to do. other Asians. <laughs> yes, exactly. I and was just, so I was just, I was like, now, now I train five, like five days a week, martial arts. Right. And I couldn't do that before because I couldn't even get out of bed. I couldn't even leave the house before. So so, and I'm training with these guys younger than me and they look older than me. I say, what? You're like, you're in your 30 something and you look like older than me and they don't have as much energy than me. Or they can't hit as hard as me. They can't move as fast as me. I was like, whoa, must be something I'm doing, right? <laughs> That's different. <laughs> must be. <laughs> so where do you see the future of your company going? I mean, I already feel like you're light years. <laughs> Threw my glasses off. I made myself laugh so hard. But you're light years ahead of so many people. But truly, where do you see the future of your of Chi Coil going? I'm um, just seeing it becoming mainstream and having people say, "Oh, did you use your Chi Coil today? Oh, do you have your Chi Coil on? Oh, what frequency are you using today?" That being just everyday conversation. Oh. That's where I see things going, right? Instead of oh, what medication you're on? Oh, what you know stuff like that, or what what doctor you're seeing. Right. Oh, uh, I am so with you, David. I that's that. I, let's create that right now. I'm going to set the attention focus that by the year of 2024, 2024, the mainstream conversation is going to be what frequency did you use today? How did you upregulate your frequency today? Did you make sure you recharged your frequency today instead of the dumb, 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 dumb questions of oh, what medications are you on? How sick are you? What people in your family are so sick? Ugh, that is such a dumb conversation. Yeah. Dumb. Can we yeah. rise above the dumbness of that, please? And elevate to, how did you optimize? David, how are you feeling so good? I want to feel as good as you. How do I do that? That's the conversation. Yes. Exactly. Yes. And if you're homesick listening to this, we know you got to get there. So get your key coiled. Oh, and David, you were so kind. I almost forgot that. Here I'm talking about sales. David has been kind and giving you all a discount code if you want to order one of your key coils today. So I want to talk about that too. Yeah. Just use uh, Kelly's discount code, Lymph Queen. Lymph Queen. One word. One word L Y M P H Q U E E N. On our website, you get 10% off our already sale prices. I'm the sales guy. Yay. A limited time offer. Buy now. Okay. <laughs> And I just want everybody to know the reason I use Lymph Queen is because I just love it when people say that I'm a queen of any kind. No, in all seriousness, I really do appreciate that. You know, that really helps people put this in their hands. And, you know, for those of you that are listening to this, if you, I want to hear from you. If you, first of all, if you have any questions, I want to hear from you. I want to know what I didn't answer because I understand that quantum is a new subject for a lot of people. I've been studying it for 25 years and it's taken me 26 of the 25 years. 
<laughs> to figure out what the hell energy is and what being really means mm -hmm. and how to live in a being state full of satisfied energy is my goal for each and every one of you and for three generations and beyond. So if there's something you don't understand, let me know so I can find the, create the podcast that will help you understand it. Number one, number two, if you do get a key coil, I want to hear about what kind of results you're getting, what kind of um, impact it's making in your life. And then let's share this with those that you know in your life, whether it's this podcast or the, the results you're getting. And let's work together to create the conversation in 24 that's mainstream about how did you upgrade your frequency today? <laughs> that's right. What frequency you're on, girl? What frequency? You know, Christine and I create retreats that are called <laughs> FFU. Did we tell you that? Which one was that? Christine and I do retreats together for women called FFU. Really? Female frequency upgrade. Oh, perfect. And at our next October event, I have a feeling we're going to have some key coils there and awesome. key coils there rather. And uh, mm. having people upgrade with that because we do a lot of that. Uh -huh. so Sound, color, and light. That's what we do at our frequencies. But I thought you would love that. Yeah. Get your groove on. How'd you increase your frequency? <laughs> I think we should get t-shirts. How'd you increase your frequency today? I've got a new t-shirt coming out. It's called Use the Chi. I was going to say Use, use the Chi. chi. Yeah. It's like good. Use the Force, but Use the Chi. You know, I've watched Star Wars. Use the Chi, Wars. Kelly. Use the Chi. My son is into Star Wars. I've okay. never watched it ever in my life. What? And I, I know. I know. There's a lot of people that are upset with me about that. Timing is everything. When the student is ready, the teacher will appear. Mm -hmm. So on Easter, I finally said, because we're going to do the whole Star Wars experience in Disney as a present to my son, because he loves it so much. And he's wanted a lightsaber forever. And I never understood this lightsaber thing. And then I watched the first Star Wars movie on Easter. And at the end of the movie, I turned to Sasha and I go, okay, it's cool. I want a lightsaber. And I Which am one did you watch? Oh God, why do I ask me such questions? It, Which so episode? <laughs> he showed it to me in chronological order. So okay. Um, chronological. Okay, I see. Darth Vader was the young yeah, guy, yeah. With the name and okay. So the the the, yeah, the uh yes. yeah, the I forgot what he called it, but yeah, episode yeah, episode one. Then. Like the fourth episode. Episode but, one is called. Yeah. Yeah, it's, yeah. yeah, so I could know, but he's told me the whole storyline, but the lightsaber was really cool. And Ian was sitting in the chair, he goes, we have our lights, we have our lightsabers right here. And I was like, oh, that's good. Yeah, these are like, like a, a modern day lightsaber, y'all. I'm not kidding. Like, I mean, whew, 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 I'm ready. I, I'm ready to take anybody on because this will charge my frequency so much mm -hmm. that much like the matrix teaches us when our frequency is as strong as we can possibly optimize it. I can see the bullets coming and I can bend out of the way of the bullets. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. Cause I am. It's, it's, it's like a, it's like that's, it's like that secret, um, crystal or secret, uh, item that the hero finds in order to defeat the bad people or holy defeat. grail it's, it's the holy grail. It's yeah. the holy. Yeah. That, that, that is the, the, the narrative that could happen in a person's life. Right. That's basically what happened in my life, right? I mean, I, I was fighting against this disease and I was about to give up. And then, I, and then I was meditating, praying, and I developed this technology that came out of nowhere, right? And then I used this device to heal myself. And then I now use it to heal other people. So that's my hero story. <laughs> It's a beautiful, and you know, I told you about the equipment I have that converts heart rate variability into sound and light, and mm -hmm. it's sound of soul. And I feel like that's my hero journey is I had found an ancient wisdom and modern technology and marrying together to help people experience that flow. And that's great for in clinic because it's it at a price point that's you know way above what an average person in their home is going to want to afford. Whereas key coil kind of can be affordable to the client and right now today. And then when they get to a clinic and they can do a son of soul, they can upgrade even further. But, and truly from my heart, David, I appreciate you. I appreciate who you are and what you've done and 
your mission. And I want to help you in every way that we can to help you accomplish your mission. And I know my community is going to love you as I have. And I know they're going to love the chi coil. I keep calling it key coil, but I don't mean to do that. It's chi coil. There's a lot of chi words in our office and in our life. And my husband has been studying martial arts forever. And <laughs> there's a lot of chi and chi and prana and kundalini. It all means the same thing. Energy. Yeah. yeah. It's just energy. And oh, you same. have your amazing energy ball in that beautiful physical suit of yours, David. And I've really appreciated getting to know you and your technology. And thank you so much. Do you have anything else you would love to say to this community about anything? Well, just um, just very thankful that there's someone like you and all of you that are listening should be very honored to be part of Kelly's community and uh to be part of this movement to part of this family that's all about frequency all about improving our health and wellness and the spiritual connectedness so thank you so much get your vibe on all that's my new thing get your vibe on vibrant beings and become a vibrant being by getting your energy amen yes. to that <laughs> so in closing place your hand on your heart everybody who's listening Feel that energy of your hand connecting to your heart. Feel that sensation and know that we are as connected to you as you are to yourself because we all are connected. I am you, you are me, I am God, you are God. We are all God experiencing life through ourselves and through each other. And I pray that each one of you connects to more people and more to yourself than ever before from this point forward, allowing you to stay in regeneration and healing mode as we are defaultly meant to be, as we are purely energetic beings having a fun, physical, vibrant experience. So vibe on people, vibe on. Much love. <laughs>